If you love Jesus, Apostolic Sunday School. Hi, everybody! Welcome once again to Apostolic Children's Ministry! We are so excited that you're here today. And Bree, you're here today and you look ex- Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you got going on? Well, you look like you've been on a, like a two-week uh, vacay or something. Oh, yes, I'm so glad you asked. I actually was on vacation. I just came oh, back you from go? the Bermuda Triangle. You came back from the Bermuda Triangle. Yes. Did you? I did. I went to all of the points. It wasn't Four Corners. It was missing one, but that was good enough. Okay, Bermuda Triangle. Okay, yeah. that's great. Uh, Where'd you well, go? Um, the swap meet. <laughs> I found my, my out, outfit there. Good? Uh, no? uh, yeah, obviously. Okay, anyway. great. Uh, uh, all right. Yeah, anyway. Well, it feels weird to be standing on this side because uh, normally I'm over there, but you know, we wanted to mix things up because at a weekly devotion, we can't be just be doing the same thing over and over again. That's true because then you guys won't pay attention to us. That's right. Well, uh, I feel bad because the last couple of weeks we have forgotten to do the uh, <clears throat> important fact of the day, and I think you've been working <gasps> oh, hard. You know, you know I looking did. in those interwebs. I was while I was away. I was looking at some fun stuff. Actually, I did find some some did a lot you? of different things. Okay. But like, which category do you want? Because there's stuff. Okay, give me some options. Place. Give me some options. Um, we have food. Oh, I love food. You Don't like food. Go no further. Okay, give perfect. us a food fact. All right. I wrote Everybody, that. drum roll, please. Food fact of the day. Uh, Let me know when to stop. Stop! <laughs> oh, sorry. Ay, 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 ay. But who's doing the fact? You! Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I was doing the drum. No! Okay, oh, food awesome. fact. All right, here we go. Okay. Lay on. Right. Okay, okay. So, I found out that... You, okay, so have you ever heard of German chocolate cake? German, yes. I do not like coconut, so I do not like German chocolate cake. Okay, well, now we know that not only does he not like coconut nor German chocolate cake, but he also doesn't realize that German chocolate cake is actually not from Germany. Oh, well... They, they, Where's it from? It's from, like, the kitchen. Oh, my goodness. Is this joke segment, oh, no, or no, no, is this no, no. fun? Oh, there's more to it. There's more to it. It was just funny. Okay. Anyway, so All right. Where's it from? Chocolate cake is not from Germany. Okay. Actually, it was named after a person. His name was Sam Germany. Are you... Are you kidding me? No, this is really serious. Okay. Like the internet All right. would never All right. lie. Anyway, it says that he... Oh, no, the internet would never, never. lie. Never. No, no, no. Mm. So, so it says that he created a type of baking chocolate for the bakers like in 1852. What? That's when Brother Philip was a teenager. That is not true. I was a teenager far lo- longer before that. Wait, wait, stop oh, it. Now okay. you got me all confused. That makes sense. Listen, they call me Father Abraham, but I'm not that old, okay? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <Dun. laughs> uh-huh. Anyway. anyway. <laughs> I, I think I have one more food fact. Oh. We're from the Inland Empire, and there's a neighboring city called San Bernardino. That's actually where your bus route is yes, from. Yes, I love that place. Well, what I just found out is uh-huh. there's a, a Mexican food restaurant called Meatlas. 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 Me- Meatlas. M I T L A S. Oh, okay. Meatlas. Okay. Across the street, there was a burger joint. Okay. The guy that ran that, his name was Glenn Bell. He ran the burger joint. Glenn but Bell. he ate at Meatlas a lot. And he loved their tacos. And he asked them, he said, hey, do you mind if I get the recipe for your tacos? Well, he had to do a lot of haggling, but he finally got the recipe from Meat Loss for tacos. And he started Taco Bell chain. Yes, he did. I promise this is true. From across the street from Meat Loss, using their recipe... And that little tiny restaurant's still there. They've never grown. They've never gotten any bigger. But Taco Bell is what it is today based on the recipe. So no. apparently with food, it doesn't matter how good your food is. It matters how good of a marketer you are. So yeah, Glenn obviously. Bell, you can look it up online. A Glenn Bell started in San Bernardino and crossed from Milas. Now I know where to go this week. <clears throat> Interesting. And I always wonder why it was Taco Bell. Like, what on earth does a bell right, have like to do with it? Where did the bell even come from? Like, did you, like, does it ding when the food's ready? Like, yeah. that's all I can Anyway, think. so, hey, the more you know. So, I got a lesson for us today. I what do. not to do when traveling? No, not that. No, 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 no. Don't, it's not, oh. don't shop at the swap meet. It's not that. Oh, but I thought that was it a good It is. Um, well, it's, it's on how people uh, should try to go to heaven. So, if you yeah. want to go to heaven, raise your left hand as high as you can and raise your right hand as high as you can. That's a good start. You, know, you worship God. Uh, but uh, because you should want to go to heaven. Yes. Because that you're means you're going to be with Jesus for eternity. Uh, but hold on. Because I have something here. Uh-oh. I have a bag. A bag. And in this bag, I have lots and lots of keys. Oh, I love keys. Yes. And I also have 
a lock. A lock? You guys see this lock? Oh. And one of these keys, if we could just drop them in this bag. Yeah, we're I just going to mix that. them all up, mix them all up, mix them all up. Oh, okay. Okay, so all the keys are in here. Oh. Now, one of these keys, I promise, unlocks this lock. Uh-huh. One of these keys. And this lock is going to be like getting to heaven. So people oh. want to go to heaven, but they try all kinds of ways to get there. It's a lot of keys. Many times they try their own ways rather than what God says to do in the Bible. Ooh. So in here, we're going to try different keys, okay? Okay. So I'm going to shake it up, All and right. you reach inside and grab a key. Can I get a look? All right, sure. Okay, just grab a key. What's something that people try to unlock the lock to get them into heaven? Some people try. Here, I'll start it off, and then you can kind of we'll, we'll trade oh, back and forth. Yes, okay? yes. <clears throat> How about good works? Oh, good works. Now, good works are important That's because true. the Bible says, you know, faith without works is dead. you got to have good works. That's if you just true. believe on God, but you don't actually act on it, that's a problem. Ooh. But you can't go to heaven just by doing good things. So this lock here, or this key rather, we're going to see if it opens. Can you get into heaven with just good works? So doing good things, is that good enough to get you into heaven? I'm sure if you do a lot of them, I'm sure there's some consideration Wait. to it. No, no, we got unlucky. Does it even I'm, fit in there? I'm... Uh, oh, it doesn't even actually, fit. Please. I'm like really actually trying. Okay. So that one didn't work. So you can't get to heaven with just good works. That's not enough. Okay. Oh, so let's mix it up. Else? Let's try another. Yep. Let's try another one. Go ahead and reach in there. Uh, yeah. What's another way that people try to get into heaven? Um, we'll set that a key aside. They, oh, oh, they go to church. That's when good. When they have to. When they have to. You yeah. mean like. When there's weddings and funerals and Easter Sunday? Yeah, and then Christmas. And Christmas. Christmas. So making sure that the basics are mm. done. Well, and, and it's good to go to church on those days, but not only. So go ahead and try it on the lock. Let's okay. see if going to church when you have to only is enough to get you into heaven. Is, there, is it even fit in the lock? Uh, this one doesn't fit No, here, here let me Maybe try it real quick. It, yeah. uh, and while we're doing that, go ahead and pull out another key. Ooh, no, okay. that one does not fit. Free will. So how about people try to get in by... Maybe the amount of money they have. Ooh. And they say, I'm going to give so much to the church <clears throat> that I'm going to kind of buy my way into heaven. Oh. You know, maybe if I give a, the pastor a big enough donation, it's going to fit. And, uh, <clears throat> Does it work? Oh, I hope so. Okay. Especially no. if you get big, big, big Oh, donations. it fit inside. <gasps> Did it really? Oh, but it won't oh. turn. No, maybe I got it to go in. Turn a little harder, maybe. No, it'll break the key off. Here, you try it. You oh. try it. See if you can get that but open. But it is in there. <clears throat> See, it's, it's like... So there. some people, they think that they have enough money or they give enough money. That's enough because a lot of people, have you seen all the billionaires and rich people that are trying to give all their money away now? Oh, yeah. Because they found out getting the money doesn't make them happy, so maybe giving it all away again will. Oh. They're going to kind of start end where they started. Uh, yeah. So let's yeah. go ahead and pull that out. That didn't work. Okay. So that's three keys. Let's shake it up and try another one. Mm. Okay. Uh, what's another way people try to get into heaven? Um, I, I think they just say, oh, well, I, I do believe in God. I believe in God. And that's enough to get me into heaven. So when I die, cross my fingers. I hope I'm going to end up there. Like I told people that I did. And I like, you know. Do you think hoping your way into heaven is a good good path? Well, why don't you try that and see if that opens it. If that opens, maybe we can make it to heaven. Oh, oh wait, did it fit in? in? All right. Oh, okay. No, we're this sure. is the okay, one. Okay. This is the one. You got it. Nice. Uh, so hoping your way into heaven isn't enough. And just believing in God isn't enough. All right. Okay, pull that out. That wasn't the one. Uh, ooh, I'm sorry. Okay, it's okay. It was the wrong key anyway. That's okay. true. We probably should throw all these keys away. Nope. Okay. Well, we have another key. And that one is, oh, if I have enough people that know about me, ooh. if I'm famous, if I have enough followers, if I'm cool enough, if I have enough friends, if people know who my mom and dad are, woo, oh, I get to go true. to heaven. Popularity. Yep, popularity. Only the popular people get to go to heaven. That's right. Heaven. Popular vote will like, get you into heaven. So pop that bad boy in there, and like that's going to do it. Like right? all the famous people in the Bible. That did, that, yeah. Uh, is that... Hold on, hold on. Oh, no. Uh, sorry, I'm just... Oh, no. I'm dyslexic. So you're telling me 500,000 followers sorry. on Instagram is not enough to get you into heaven. <laughs> you're telling me Twitter account or X account, whatever they call it now, that's not enough to get you into heaven? It doesn't work. Okay, get rid of it. It's not, it's not going to work. Yep, just try another one. <laughs> mm, I don't know if it is. Oh, I found no, one. There's, okay, there's, no, there's another one. Okay, there's a couple left. I think there's... <sighs> okay. So what is this key going to be? How are people trying to get into heaven now? You know, I think it's going to be like how good... At video games we are. And wow. Like, I don't think I've ever heard anyone express that, but I bet they've been thinking that. If I just practice my call of duty honestly, enough, that's enough to get me into heaven. Or right? just like how much fun you can have. 
and now you're throwing heaven. So yeah, people think that the, if I just have enough fun. A lot of fun, because who doesn't want to have fun? Heaven's going to be fun, so obviously earth's okay. got to be fun. Well, let's find out. Go okay. ahead and see if that pops <gasps> a lot. It worked! It did it! It did! Open it up! Uh, okay, hold on. Um, no, it's going to work. Hold on. But it fit in. Give me a second. Yeah, yeah. I don't think this one worked either. Let's shake them up. There's a couple left. Okay. So go ahead and go ahead and grab grab another one. I hope this works. Here, let's get rid of that key. That one didn't work. Yeah, useless to us. They think if I'm just a good enough person. Mm. Now I, I'm not a a bad sinner. I don't I don't like do bad things. I you don't know, murder people. Yeah, I mean I I'm honest. I have good integrity. I don't steal from people. I treat people right. right. True. Now I don't do what the Bible says necessarily, but. But I'm a good person. But overall. You know, and the Bible talks about people like that. And I, my, 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 my dad, Bishop, he preaches a message called Herod was a good old boy. And it was just how this, there was a King Herod that was with John. He was just a good guy. Hmm. But he didn't make it to heaven. But let's see if Ooh. that opens it up. That's let's try to open and see if just being a good guy is enough to get you into heaven. Hold on. Oh, that's not even fitting in the lock? No. Uh -oh. oh, no. I think we're in trouble. Okay, get rid of it. I think there's only one key left, Okay. Let's try the last one. I mean, we've tried everything else. So go ahead and just... I hope that's the one. I hope so. We've, we've tried them all. But this one, before you even try it, okay. is based on what the Word of God says. Now, we've randomly grabbed all these, and that just happens to be the last one left. In Acts chapter 2, verse 38, Then Peter said unto them, Repent. Repent. And be baptized. How? In the name of Jesus Christ. And ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. And then, and only then, will you be ready to go to heaven. That's the plan of salvation. That's the plan to be saved. And there is no other way. Jesus said, I am the door. Anybody that tries to go around, go any other way, the same as a thief You mean we can't just robber. have a bunch of money? We can't just be philanthropic? We can't just be good people? We can't no. just not murder people? No, you, all of those things are people that are things that people in the world we chase after. And they, they think that's going to, if I just reach the top of that specific ladder, that's going to get me to heaven. It's going to make me a good person, a good enough to make it into heaven. But the Bible says there's only one way, only one way to heaven. Ooh. And let's see if it's repentance, baptism in Jesus' name, receiving the gift of the Holy Ghost. Now go ahead and try it. It's the last key. Let's I'm scared. See. What if it doesn't work and they're looking? <sighs> I trust God. Let's go ahead and pop it open and let's see what it says. See what happens. Okay, first of all, does it even fit? Does it fit in the lock? It does. Okay. It does? Okay, now hold it up where everybody can see it and let's see if it actually opens. Here we go. Repentance, re being baptized in Jesus' name, receiving the gift of the Holy Ghost. Is it going to open? And it opened, everybody. Look at it. We opened the lock. You get to go to heaven when you repent. You're baptized in Jesus' name, receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. That's the only way. I was so stressed. Jesus said, you have to be born again of water and of the Spirit to enter the kingdom of heaven because without that you ain't going. Oh, there you have it right there. It's very clear. There's only one way to get into heaven. Only one way to get the lock open wow. and that is with the key of Acts chapter 2 verse 38. Isn't Repentance, be baptized, receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. That's the key. Woo. That's it. It's amazing how we went through the whole bag before we, we found the key that worked. We went and I've seen people that try that. They try all the wrong stuff before they try the right ones. Kids, you're at a young enough age. You can do it now. You can skip all those other keys. You don't have to try all the all the goofy keys. You can go straight to the one that works. Yes, let's do and that. And I believe it, that you guys are going to do it. All right, guys, we'll see you next time. So Thanks good. for joining us once again on the Weekly Devotion. God bless. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye.